the failure of the pot. Part 2. Absalom's death. Absalom began to follow Hushai's advice. And then he was like gathering the whole nation. He was like. And also a lot of people were with David. And David had a big army. They were like thousands. Then there was like a big battle or something. There were like lots of so David has a lot of soldiers and he divided it. He set his general Joab over one sorry. Of over a third. Then he set Joab's brother over another third. Then he set a man over the other third. And then the battle like waged. Let's get back to Absalom. He was ga galloping through the forest on his mule. And then when he was like riding under an oak tree, he like tanged himself. And then the mule went, went on under him. He was like... And then a young man saw Absalom on the tree. Oh, here's what David reminded Joab and the other leaders of the thirds of his soldiers. He said, be gentle with Absalom. He is my son. And then the young man saw Absalom hanging in the tree. He went to Joab and said, Joab, I have saw Absalom hanging from an oak tree. Joab's, Joab was a stern soldier made of iron. Was it iron or bronze or silver? Iron. Iron. Then Joab said, Why didn't you kill him? I would have given you ten silver pieces and a belt. <coughs> then the young man said, If you would have give me a, given me a thousand pieces of silver, I, I, um, you heard David's order. Be gentle with Absalom because he is his son. But Joab didn't listen. He went over to Absalom and taking three javelins, he thrust them into the, into the, in, in, into the heart of the young man. And then all the soldiers and the, and then Joab's soldiers came to him and killed Absalom. 
They took him down from the oak tree and threw him into a pit. And then Joab uh, blew a trumpet to stop the battle. Um, boom, boom. And then the echo was like through the forest. The battle stopped. And then the jo and then the soldiers surrounded Joab and threw stones at Absalom until he was like buried under the stones. Why did Joab stop the battle? Hmm? Hmm? Because what is a soul, what is an army without the leader? Hmm? Just looking around. And Ahima, Ah, Ah, Ahimo, Ah, 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 Ahimas, ah 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 Ahimas, the brother of Jonathan, is that right? And Ahimas, the brother of Jonathan, isn't Jonathan dead already? Never mind. Okay. Nothing. Just enough. Just a notification. Okay. Well, Ahima is the brother of Jonathan. Mm. Said to Joab, "I want to deliver the good news that the battle is won." Joab said, "Joab didn't want Ahima to go. So another man was sent." Mm -mm 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 -mm. So, but Ahimaaz really wanted to deliver the good news. Finally, Joab gave, gave in. <sighs> Fine, go. And then Ahimaaz went after the other man until he overtook him. Dumbie, dumbie, dum, 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 dum. And then both of them were like race cars. They're like, and then David was sitting in the door of his step pastor. And then the watchman said, Look, I see a man running across the desert. He delivers good news. I, I'm sorry. He delivers news about the battle. Says David. Said David. Look! I see another man running. delivers news about the battle, said Hi. David. No! I see the first one runs like Ash Ahimaaz, 
said the watchman. Ahimaaz is a good man and he delivers good news, said David. Said David. And then Ahimaaz came to, until he was close enough to be heard. And he said, all is well, the battle is won. Salom say, says David, when Joab ordered me to come, I saw a great commotion, but yet I did not know what it was. Let us wait until this other man comes. And then there comes this other man. Dumby, 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 dumby. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Other Man. All is well, says the other, the other man. Is Absalom safe, says David. Oh, my king David, be your son like all your other enemies. David was like grief stricken. Grief, David. He went up to his, up to the room above the wall and he went to the window and his and he wept. Oh Absalom, my son, my son, how I could have died for you, my son, my son. And then the soldiers came with joy in their hearts that the battle was on. Dum dum be dum. But when they heard the cry of, Oh, Absalom, my son, my son, my son. <coughs> they wept with David. Now you have brought, um, no, no. Now you have brought sadness into your soldiers who have won the battle, said Joab. Go. Now I see, David, that you love, that you hate you. That you love your enemies and hate your friends. If Absalom had died, sorry, if I, if we, if Absalom have lived, and have we had all died, you would be much pleased. And Joab said. Your soldiers have won the battle. You have brought peace. You, you have brought sadness in their hearts. So come down here and thank them because I, they have won the battle. That's it. That's all? Okay, I have a question for you. I have a question for you.
question for you can you tell me give can you tell me emotion emotion of king david towards his son he felt um when when he heard the news of absalom's death he he was grief stricken didn't you hear him weep Oh, Absalom, my son, my son, my son. How I could have died for you, my son, my son, my son. Okay, the next question. Hmm? Uh, what do you think? Uh, sorry, give me the emotions of Absalom towards his father. Hmm. He, he wants Absalom wants to to kill david so that he can have the kingdom okay what do you call that emotion rebellion yes correct okay another one give me the emotion give me one emotion of joab one of king david's mm -hmm. general against who to when he to king saw david Absalom to king david when he said when he said you have to go down and thank your soldiers um i don't know he just said that what do you think is emotion or emotions when I he said that to the king i don't know you can guess you really don't know. Okay, okay, okay. It's okay, it's okay. So stop? Yes, thank you.